Good evening. We begin tonight with something our country and our state is struggling with right now. Talking about the skills gap, trained workers in high demand. We're talking about carpenters, electricians, plumbers, mechanics, welders. And now the Caldwell School, uh, Caldwell School is looking to fill that need. Our Andrew Bartline was at Elevate Academy today, a 6th through 12th grade technical school. He spoke with local businesses that have partnered with the school in hopes of closing that so-called skills gap. Andrew. Yeah, Elevate Academy teaches its students technical skills like you mentioned, welding, construction, and some local businesses are having a hard time finding the skill workers they need. And they say a partnership just makes sense. The help wanted signs are everywhere. And this has been going on for the last couple of years. And finding workers to fill those roles isn't easy. It's getting even harder. Especially for the trades. Ultimate. Because they're hiring for a specific set of skills. But we end up having to interview about 25 people to find one good candidate. Mike Dale owns Royalty Electric and says there's enough work in the Treasure Valley for his company to triple in size. But he's been blocked from expanding because he can't find enough electricians to hire. We no longer look around for the guy that's been in the business for 20 years and who's seen everything. We're, we're looking for people, young, young people that have potential to want to work, to want to do their job with excellence. So he's turned to Elevate Academy, a 6 through 12 technical school in Caldwell. English, math, science, and social studies is taught directly within a trade. So they're really taking total control of their own education. Some students choose welding, while others are drawn to carpentry. And all students have to have a job lined up in order to graduate. If it wasn't for this school, I possibly could have dropped out of high school. Katie Martinez enrolled at Elevate when the school started three years ago. She's most interested in manufacturing and is working toward an internship with Peterbilt. Being able to just have that head start and figure out what you like and what you don't like, what kind of path you want to create for yourself in the long run, um, is so beneficial at this age because we're figuring out who we are right now and what we want to become. It's stories like these that benefit local businesses too as they're trying to fill job openings. I think the fact that the school here is so responsive in terms of career placement is, is really kind of their secret sauce. And most importantly, find the right candidate. And so we appreciate Elevate Academy and that they're teaching all of those principles ahead of time. Elevate's founder tells me they also have culinary, firefighting, even business classes, graphic design. So they serve a wide range of interests and the students I talk to say that Elevate puts them in a position to succeed. They introduce them to local businesses, make that connection. But after that mark, it's on the students to foster those relationships because like I said, if you don't have a job, you can't graduate. Yeah, you know, many are realizing that you really don't have to attend a four-year university to land a well-paying job and a career and obviously the Yellow Brick Road could be right there for so many of those kids. All right, Andrew, thank you.